Hi, this is Jerry from Midwest Cam Solutions. Let's take a look at how Volumil can help reduce your cycle times and extend your tool life. I'm going to show you the difference between an old school style tool path and a Volumil tool path. This is the old school tool path. Um, you can see that the end mill is plunging in, especially right in this area here, and you're taking a, a, a pretty heavy cut on that tool, but you're also only using the end of the end mill, stepping down. Um, over here is a volume mill tool path. What we do with a volume mill tool path is it's called chip thinning. You use the entire length of the end mill, a high axial, low radial step over. Much easier on your machine, easier on your equipment, less likely to move your part. <clears throat> You're also using the whole end mill so that when you send it in for a resharp, you've used the whole thing. Oftentimes with uh, old school tool path, what we end up doing is just basically cutting the end of the tool off. Volume mill tool paths are probably two to three times faster on the feed rate. It's easier on the machine, less likely to move your part, use the whole end mill. Uh, these tool paths also are very easy to program. And the nice part is if you're doing one-off parts, your guys can actually program this. I used to do this in the field. We would actually program the roughing portion of our part, put it in the machine, let it run while we program the rest of our part. Um, saving a lot of time doing it that way. By using a volume mill tool path, to, uh, the metal removal rate is so much higher than an old school tool path that you can actually compete with a 50 taper machine using a 40 taper machine and you can bid jobs uh, competitively that you otherwise couldn't. Thanks for watching. If you or your programmers need help setting one of these up, uh, we are here to help. If you would like more information, please contact us at Midwest Cam Solutions. We'll be happy to help you. Or check out our YouTube channel. There's many great tutorials there. Thank you.